feel like I should just take this. Take this and then finish my development, like with G3. So what we're going to do now is, I'm, I'm thinking we just create threats. Continue to create threats. So I play the move G3, Black has to make a decision. Black plays the passive move, moving back. Now, for example, I have Bishop H3, which develops a piece with a... What we're doing is we're, we're, we're creating something called an initiative. In chess, an initiative is when you create a lot of threats, and in doing so, you also improve your position. The cockpit is not answering their phone. Our number one has been stabbed, and our five has been stabbed. Sam, what are call from Washington? I am in a situation where the Americans learned a possible hijack. What's going on, Benny? The crap is erratic again. Problem is very erratic. Where were you on 9-11? It is a question that will always be asked, and for every person will have a different answer, except for 16 Sarasota children. They were only seven years old, sitting together in a classroom with President George W. Bush when he learned our nation was under attack. He learned our nation was under attack. When he learned our nation was under attack. Like with G3. So what we're going to do now is, I'm, I'm thinking we just create threats. Continue to create threats. So I play the move G3, Black has to make a decision. Black plays the passive move, moving back. Now, for example, I have Bishop H3, which develops a piece with a... What we're doing is we're, we're, we're creating something called an initiative. In chess, an initiative is when you create a lot of threats, and in doing so, you also improve your position. He brought America to its knees. The world expected him to be caught and made to pay the price. I want justice. Uh, there's an old poster out west, as I recall, that said, wanted, dead or alive. But three years later, Osama bin Laden is nowhere to be found. The trail has gone cold, and the threat is more dangerous than ever. What happened to the greatest manhunt in history? For the first time, the key players involved in the hunt for the terrorist leader tell their story. Veteran CIA agent Gary Schroen was given one last mission. Our marching orders were pretty straightforward. I want bin Laden's head packaged in dry ice and shipped back. Twelve days later, Schroen led a CIA team into northern Afghanistan with five million dollars and a license to kill. Had kind of an inter interesting perspective about the weapons of mass destruction. Uh, I was in Baghdad in the weeks prior to the invasion, and then as the invasion began, I switched and joined the American forces as they were entering Iraq. And I, when I was in Baghdad before the war, I was there when the inspectors were demanding access to Saddam's palaces, um, and he, was, he wouldn't let them come in uh, for reasons that are unclear now, because in fact there weren't any of the weapons that, uh, that Bush said existed. When the war started and I was with the American forces, they had maps with bunkers marked on them where they thought the weapons would be or they were certain they'd find them, and of course none were found. Even though later uh, they did find you know, remnants of uh, chemical weapons from the Iraq-Iran war that uh, had been made prior to 1991 and were virtually useless, the bottom line is that the weapons that the Bush administration said were there didn't exist. develops a piece with a, what we're doing is we're, we're, we're creating something called an initiative. In chess, an initiative is when you create a lot of threats, and in doing so, you also improve your position. If queen b5, queen e4, don't I just take the... It is said Bartholdi modeled the sculpture after the Roman goddess Libertas. The truth is, Le is Libertas was an echo of the Egyptian goddess Isis. After Bartholdi's Colossus was rejected for the Suez Canal due to financial reasons, he repurposed it as the Statue of Liberty for New York Harbor. It comes as no surprise that the cornerstone for the Statue of Liberty was laid in a Masonic ceremony. Researcher Jim Allison has connected also wore a crown of seven rays. Seven Rays is very interesting in light of the culmination of the initiation ceremony into the cult of Isis. According to 19th century author Edward Schur, 
after a successful initiate survived all the harrowing tests and triumphed over death by fire, water, and temptation of the senses, he was led into an inner sanctum where he looked upon a colossal metal statue of Isis crowned with a diadem of seven rays. I believe seven is Isis's secret number.